Hi, I'm Scott Markwood, Training Coordinator here at Hayful America Company. And I'm Daniel Tripp, Product Manager for all things kitchen related here at Hayful America. Now we're in the Learning Center installing a tall pantry unit called Levito. If you've got one of these to install, you're going to want to make sure you have your mounting instructions in hand as well as this handy template. Now let's get started. First, find and mark the center of your cabinet opening on the bottom. Mark at the front and back of the cabinet. Next, position the template and secure it with masking tape. Note that the position of the template depends on whether there's a face frame or if the door is inset or overlay. For face frame overlay or frameless overlay, the template comes all the way out to the front edge of the cabinet. For face frame inset, the template is placed at the back side of the face frame. We'll mark all the hole locations and then pre-drill using a 5mm drill bit. Avoid the temptation of swapping out the screws. These 5mm screws are critical for safe installation. Next, we position the base runner and install it using the provided 5mm Euro screws. Now we'll find the location of the top bracket. Measure back from the front edge of the cabinet and then measure up from the floor of the cabinet. Mark those locations. The top bracket is expandable to match the interior width of your cabinet. Once you've assembled it to the proper width, you'll see there are quite a few hole options to choose from in order to achieve the exact width you need. Before tightening it down, verify that the bracket is the same size as your cabinet interior width. Install the top bracket using the provided screws. Now we're going to pre-drill and install the bottom security bracket. We're using a self-centering drill bit known as a VIX bit. We'll mark and pre-drill these locations. Then we secure the bracket with the screws provided. This bracket is important not only because it helps hold the unit firmly in place when the unit is pulled forward, it also adds some rigidity to the floor of the cabinet. Next, we install the top tray onto the frame. Secure it to the frame with the hex wrench provided with the unit. Once the top tray is installed, we're ready to install the frame into the bottom runner. This comes in from the back and then slides forward. Be sure the green safety clip snaps shut. With the bottom in place, slide the top runner back and attach it to the top bracket. Then snap the cover cap in place on the bottom runner. Install the lower trays by sliding them into the frame, twisting the lock to the side, and then lifting up. The decorative glass trim pieces can be installed either before or after installing the tray onto the frame. That's up to you. Before we attach the handle to the shelf, clean the tray surface so the adhesive will adhere properly. Peel off the paper backing, press the handle into position, and hold firmly for a few seconds. That's it! Just add the pantry doors and your Levito pantry unit is ready to go to work. We hope you found this Hayful of Video helpful. Good luck with your installation, and thanks for watching!